In his own words, Mayor Eric Adams has brought swagger to New York City. From his walkout song How you doing? to his promises to crack down on crime. But he himself now charged with several crimes, including campaign finance, bribery, and conspiracy. A just unsealed indictment against him found for nearly a decade, Adams sought and accepted improper valuable benefits, such as luxury international travel, including from wealthy foreign business people and at least one Turkish government official seeking to gain influence over him. The mayor had a duty to disclose these gifts on his annual public disclosure forms so that the public could see who was giving him what. But as we allege, year after year after year, he kept the public in the dark. Adams accused of threatening the jobs of New York City fire officials if they did not allow the new Turkish consulate to open, despite multiple safety concerns, following years of accepting campaign contributions and luxury travel. More than a dozen other city officials ensnared in the federal investigations, four of them planning to leave office or are already gone. The school chancellor deciding to retire following a home raid. The police commissioner earlier this month Resign. There's no such thing as a free lunch. If somebody's giving you something, if they're giving you free flights and free hotel rooms, they want something in return. When he hid this and took the free gifts, it looks like he was, uh, you know, bought off by the Turkish uh, individuals in their government. A defiant Adams promising he won't back down. And I ask New Yorkers to wait to hear our defense before making any judgments. Some elected officials, though, already calling on him to resign. I think for the best of the city and so that we can continue to staff the administration of the city, it would be best for Mayor Adams to stay Now, New York Governor Kathy Hochul does have the power to remove Mayor Adams from office. So far, she's said she is aware of the concerning reports and is monitoring the situation. I'm Christine Frizzau reporting.